Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Daisy. In today's tutorial, we're going to be sewing Christmas fabric face masks. They are perfect for the whole family. They are comfortable and easy to breathe. Don't worry if you're new at sewing. These face masks are very easy to sew. And for this project, we're going to need fabric, either 100% cotton, polycotton, or muslin. I am using two pieces of 100% cotton, 14 by 7 inches, and one piece of muslin, 11 by 7 inches. I'm going to write down all the materials in the video description or in my website. Also, we're going to need elastic, two strips of elastic or similar, 10 by 12 inches, or two elastic hair ties. The seamless elastic hair ties are very soft on your ears. They are thick, but you may slice them in two or four if you can. And this is optional. Two elastic stoppers, and if you're going to customize them, you're going to need iron-on vinyl. And last but not least, we're going to need the pattern. You may download the free pattern in my website, daisymultifacetica.com. I'm going to leave you the link in the video description. You're going to find nine free patterns for kids and adults. Go to the freebie section, scroll down to find the one that you're looking for, download and print. Let's start by cutting the fabric. Let's take the two bigger pieces of fabric and fold them in half. Put them together and place the pattern on top. Secure it with pins and cut. And the same we're going to do with the third piece of fabric. The only difference is that this piece of fabric is smaller. And for that, we're going to fold the pattern on the second line. Place it on top of the fabric, secure it with pins and cut. Now we're going to sew on the curved area, but before we're going to place the smaller pieces together either with the red one or the green one. Secure it with pins and let's go to the sewing machine. We can leave them like this, but if you have a serger machine, you may serge it. Now let's place the two layers together with the stitches on the outside. Align them, secure them with pinks, and we're going to sew top and bottom leaving 3 eighths of an inch seam allowance. Mm -hmm. 
Let's sew only top and bottom, leaving 3 8 of an inch seam allowance. And this is optional. Iron and turn inside out. We're going to fold 3 8 of an inch on the sides and iron. When we finish ironing, we're going to tuck that folded part inside and iron again. Secure the sides with pins and sew all around, leaving one fourth of an inch seam allowance. Iron it and we're going to fold the sides to make the loop for the elastic. The fold is going to be between 3 quarters of an inch to 1 inch. Secure it with pins and sew, leaving the area where the elastic is going to go. Since this face mask is going to be reversible, you can fold either way. Now that we already sew the loops for the elastic, we're going to insert the elastic. And now I'm going to insert the elastic stoppers. If you don't have elastic stoppers, you can just make a knot on each side. Thank you. 
And here we have the reversible fabric face mask. We can leave it like that, it looks beautiful. But if you wish to customize it, I'm going to show you really quick how you can customize it with iron on final using your Cricut machine. Here is the reversible fabric face mask with Christmas design. If you would like to sew this project, I invite you to visit me on my website, daisymultifacetica.com, where you can download all of my free patterns. I have nine sizes for kids and adults. I'm going to leave you the link in the video description. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like my video.
Thank you for your visit and I'll see you in my next tutorial.